made so uh, it's all reassembled and uh, ready for a, a demonstration uh, one of the things I like to do with with these is uh, set a set a one on the register here and uh, one positive forward turn and you get a one there and a one in the counter and turn it backwards and then turn it backwards again and what you should see is it subtract one from the zeros and you get a nice ripple carry of nines all the way across and then the bell rings with the underflow and forwards again that's nice uh, what to do next uh, I don't know uh, random number clear the um, input clear the registers so a, uh, a multiplication let's see uh, five six seven eight uh, multiply by one two three four so one two three four and then carry to the right one two three one two one so one two three four times five six seven eight is uh, seven million six thousand six hundred and fifty two and uh, I'll try a division now so for a division start with the carriage all the way to the right I'll divide uh, 22 by 7 so you put you enter the 22 into the uh, result register with a positive turn and then you clear the uh, counter register without clearing the, the result register and you do that by operating this lever here clear so the one's gone from there but the 22 is still in there seven in there and then uh, negative turns to subtract and then when it underflows bell rings uh, correct for that with a positive turn and then turn uh, move the carriage one place to the left and repeat and you can do this without looking because you're just guided by the sound of the bell So there we are, 22 divided by 7 is 3.1428571. And uh, clear. And what's, what's neat about these machines is that they, um, they're, all, uh, they're all operated uh, by the right hand. All the controls are on the right hand side, uh, <laughs> which is fine if you're right handed. Anyway, so there we go. Um, it's uh, it's uh, it's a nice a nice thing. And bearing in mind how what it was like uh, when I got it, uh, I think it's looking pretty good, and uh, and I'm happy with that.